Good afternoon, everyone. I present to your attention the work of a plugin, Copy at Monitor It. The plugin is a strong extension of a standard Revit functionality for copying and monitoring elements and will allow you to more accurately determine change in the position of the monitored elements as well as their parameters. So, let's assume that we have a heating model that has four boilers. Each of these boilers must be powered with electricity. To do this, you need to issue a task to electricians. Let's open the electricians model and load the connection with the heating model there. Now let's look at the problem. We are now an electrician and we need to make a copy and monitor those elements that we are given as a task. To do this, we need to copy these elements first to our model. How can we do this? We can do this by copying and monitoring using the project. But at the same time, you see, you can't physically copy some categories. And even if you could, then you can only track changes in the position. And that's it. Now let's look and how our plugin works. Click on the copy and monitoring button. The plugin offers us the format of work. How we will work, manually or not. If you click yes, then the plugin will allow you to select one or more elements and eventually only work with it. But if, for example, you want to copy all the elements of a certain family, from the model at once. When you can click on the plugin, click No. Select the link from which you want to make a copy. Here you will have all the families from the linked model displayed. In this case, our boiler. Also, if you want to filter by some parameter, you can do it. Let's look at it right away. Let's switch to the heating model. Let's put some more families here. It doesn't matter which families they are. Let's assume that we want to pass only four boilers as a task. So we select them and then, for example, write task in the comment. We keep out heating model. We switch to the electric model, update the heating connection. Click on the copying and monitoring plugin. Select our connection. Here we already see three families but we would like to filter by parameter. So we keep the parameter name and its value. As a result, we only have a boiler. Let's choose it. Click on the button that we will monitor exactly and click OK. At this moment, our family is being copied. If I hide the connection, then I will see that these elements are now in my model. But what does it give us? This makes it possible to track certain actions for these elements. You can see this in the Monitoring Manager plugin. Open it. Select our connection and we see what four families are displayed here. They are now filled with gray lines. This means that nothing has happened to it since we monitored it. Now let's make change to the heating model. Let's go into it. Let's do the following. We will remove this boiler. We will move this boiler and we mean this boiler. We will replace some parameter. For example, Mark instead of 2 
we will write 200. Let's save the heating model. Let's switch to the electric model updated. The connection has been updated. Now, if we go to the Monitoring Manager plugin, select our connection, when we will already see changes. The first line is gray, which means that the first boiler has not changed in any way. The second line is green, where it says that the parameter have been changed. Which parameters have been changed, we can find out by clicking on the, this button. We see that the mark parameter was 2 and became 200. The next element has changed its position. This is the third element that we had here and moved here. And the fourth element was removed from us. In order to synchronize, we can select these elements line by line or click select all and click on the Scenes button. At the same time, the plugin will ask you, will we delete one element? And after that, we had a synchronization. That is, this element has moved. In this element, the mark parameter has changed by 200. Nothing has happened to this element, and the fourth element has been removed from our model because it was removed from the associated model. Let's open the Monitoring Manager plugin again and see what we now have three lines here. And they are all gray because everything corresponds. What else can we do with this plugin? We can select an element, for example, select the first line and click on the select button. We select an element. We can look at the parameters but in this case, the parameters have not changed. We can also stop monitoring if we click on this button. Once again, we go into this plugin. Then we will already see two lines, because we have removed monitoring from the first element. Thus, with the help of this plugin, you can easily copy elements to yourself from the linked model as well as track their changes both by position and by deletion, or by changing parameters. That's it! Thank you everyone! Subscribe to the channel, put likes! In description of the video you can find a link to download plugins to the free trial version in 2 weeks. All bye!